Inside this bed is a hidden gaming room. You've got to check this out, it's insane. We have a crazy mission for this hidden gaming room. Step one, go shopping for a bed that we can modify into a gaming room. Step two, bring the bed back to the warehouse to begin the gaming room conversion. Oh. Step three, return the bed back to the store with Andrew hidden inside the bed. Let's hope this works. We're at the furniture store, it's time to find us a bed. This is the exact store we took the couch to, <laughs> so we're not exactly sure if they're gonna recognize us or what's going on, but we need to look around. <laughs> comes to a bed, we need enough space below the bed to make the hidden room. Oh, it's kind of like a couch. We can almost take out this beam, raise it up a little bit, and then have much more wiggle room for gaming. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Oh. It's like I've done this before. Yeah. You're right. Boys, hide. Hey. Hi. Yeah, you're Jason too, right? Yeah. yeah. We were just actually looking to actually get a bed. All right. For this next video, yeah. Hidden <laughs> gaming room. <laughs> bed. <laughs> a little hatch. Oh, yes, love the hatch. Hmm, not bad. This one has a lot of drawers, so that might be an issue, but I should climb in probably to test. Okay. Back, spinal, back, spinal. This isn't a good sign. <coughs> Whoa, it's pretty cool. That's a lot of work. The only problem with the doors is it's not quite hidden. Kind of more obvious gaming room, right? <laughs> <laughs> Andrew, what do you think about this? Now envision it with me. It's three stories. The triple story bed gaming room. You come in on the bottom, wall up the side. You can make your way up this bed to get into the second room, a completely different gaming room. Go up to the top, we got the sky room. I think that's a pretty cool idea. If we were to return it, we'd probably have to wall off the entire thing, otherwise it's just a see-through gaming room. I'd be confused what this humongous giant box is. <laughs> yeah, we got this bed and we don't like it anymore. Can't <laughs> see out of it. <laughs> We found a few options that may work, but we're going to go to a different furniture store to see if they may have something better. What do you think about this bed? That is probably one of the worst beds we could buy for this project. Not much room at all. Literally the worst. All right, we'll take it. I guess we'll have to do the crib. Are you sure that's the best option? No, but have you ever seen a hidden gaming room in a crib? Never seen that before. Technically, all of them have been. In my crib. Hey. <laughs> Uh -oh. oh no. Oh. Are you ready for me to destroy the multiverse? With what? Oof. I don't feel so good. I'm putting in my two weeks. <laughs> Guys, check out this sick light I found. Watch what happens. Don't wow. ever buy that. I want that. You don't. Matt, I don't know what you just did, but that hurt. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I found a bed. How are you so strong? The bed's not very heavy. Uh, actually, it's super heavy, yeah. <laughs> you actually scared me. How many gaming rooms have you made in your life, you think? 300. <laughs> Jabs texted. Please give Darren a raise as of immediately. Oh, you guys are awesome. Jake, it's a pleasure to uh, chat with you. Like I mentioned, Darren is over there if you want to chat with him. Beautiful furniture. We'll be back for another bed in the future, buddy. We are back at the warehouse now. Samuel, take a look at our gaming bed. Man, this is probably the best bed I've ever seen in my life. Oh, please. This is like as bare bones as you possibly can be on a bed. The reason it's bare bones is we can modify the heck out of it to make it an ultimate hidden gaming room. And there's actually a lot of room under here. I already went under there. I could bench press this whole thing. You wanna show me? So yeah, that's kind of the pros of, of this bed. Lightweight, a lot of room for our uh, building and letting our imagination just go wild. Wild. Imagination. All right. I mean, how wild is the imagination gonna go on this? There's a lot of things we could do. We could have, have a canopy where you had to like climb up a ladder and then you have a, I don't know. But anyways, one thing we do <laughs> want is we want this mattress to flip open like a hatch. Like a hatch. To get inside the game room. Man, you guys ask for more and more and more every single time we do one of these builds. Well, the fans keep telling us to do that. Oh, it's the you can fans, blame the fans yeah. fault. I won't blame you guys. So what do you give this bed out of 10? Is it a doable bed or does it have to go straight in the dumpster? I mean, you couldn't have picked a bed that needed more work. It'd be better to just build a bed from scratch. And that's what we're basically gonna have to do, so. <laughs> At least we have the receipt that we bought the bed. That's what's that's gonna be true. key for returning it later. Whether it looks like what's on the receipt is irrelevant. That's a good point. Irrelevant. 
And we can. And if they say that, I'll say irrelevant. <laughs> what do you guys think is realistic to do in three days? Does it have to float? It's probably good for it to be able to float because who knows what's going to happen to it. We make a boat instead. <laughs> what the plan is, add a compartment down here that will become our gaming room and to raise the bed up so that we have as much room as possible. Try to attach a TV to this wall, snack stations, memory foam, mattress. That way you can sleep inside of your bed as somebody sleeps on top of the bed and you'll both get a great night of sleep. This is what I think. Please don't let Samuel have to tell you what to do. It's about taking action. Oh, oh the wood piece fell out. Ouch. What are we doing? If this is how they build skyscrapers, then I don't know how. Samuel did this by himself. There is no way that Samuel did this by himself. Progress update. As you can see, we, there is a giant hole now cut in the bed because flap open to inside gaming room. And what else? We have raised it up, right, Samuel? It'll be a lot more roomy inside of it other than a... Blah, 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 blah. It's gonna be more roomy now. Is this stable? Jump at your own peril. I love jumping on the bed. Three little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped his head. The next phase is putting these white beams across the bottom. That way we can build a box on the inside like this. And then once these are all installed, we'll be able to build the base in here for the gaming room. And by we, we mean Samuel. No, <laughs> we're helping. <laughs> actual real pain. We're on a side quest. We're at Best Buy now. We want to get as much gaming supplies as we can for this hidden gaming room. We need new TVs, maybe new games, accessories. One thing we need is a really tiny screen for inside the gaming room. There's not a lot of room. I found this guy pretty small. I'm hoping they have it in stock and it's quality. It's in thin, oh, light. Oh. You have to keep that in, Matt. Need to get some pillows as well since we're looking for comfort. I got a lot of gaming pillows. So let's get a few of these guys. And we're gonna pick up some new video games, of course. So let's just grab a few of the uh, best ones. All right, guys, I'm here with Ken. <laughs> we're at the grocery store now because must have snacks. Oh, oh. Chips. Where's the truffle oil? No, not those ever. Space balls. <laughs> merchandising, merchandising. Whoa. Cinnamon sugar stuff. Let's go. Chocolate milk. Yeah, not gonna work, pal. It's called balance. Have you tried this? No, I haven't. Ah, uh, it looks pretty good. Donuts. Remember those? Yes, those are bussin'. Donuts. We got the bag. The bed is ready for its first strength test. We have all of the added features to conceal the gaming room inside, so I'm gonna climb in. No cracking sound. That's good. Now this to see sick. how heavy it is, we have the construction ears here. One, two, three. Oh. Oh. <laughs> this feels like a weird amusement park ride. Oh my gosh. <laughs> two. <laughs> three. Okay. Did anybody hear any cracks? Something in my back. <laughs> we have made some serious progress on the gaming bed. We've got the hatch installed. We've got the screen in here, the PS5, the power supply. It's coming along nicely. Once we get this painted all black, just like any normal bed. This is one of the cooler builds. Cooler than the couch. Because there's way more space, it takes it to the next level. You could fit two people in here and do split screen gaming. Dude, we have got to try. Here are the extra snack shelves that we still need to install inside because you can't go anywhere without snacks. Hey, Reese. Hi. What are you working on? Sonic Mania. Are you just gaming? You already got the gaming set up? I think he's just testing he's the games, right? Yeah, every good builder has to just test his work. I love Sonic. Time to install the special shelf. Whoa, this is so cool in here. I gotta find a spot to put the snack shop. Oh my goodness. Oh, what the? We're trying the top. <coughs> Who, who's trying it? Me, Isaac Quazzo. No, please no. No, God, please no! Me, Isaac, Blake, Reese, Rick, Samuel, Drew, Matt, we're oh. all getting on. No, please. Please remember the monkeys on the bed story. Ah! Now we'll put the hat with the bed on. Okay. Ooh, one-handed. Oh. It folds perfectly? What? How does it look from that side? Don't look at me. Don't look at me! That bed is perfect. Open it again. It could be like one of those adjustable beds. I can't push you up. Oh, that's nice for my acid <laughs> reflux. <laughs> now all that's left is to paint it and return it to the store. Yes. Two people can lift it, but it's heavy. probably lighter than the couch. The couch was pretty heavy. Oh, oh God. Oh. Okay, we did it. Okay, it's up. Now what? <laughs> Go back down. Okay. So I think overall this one will be a a lighter build. Which is why we got this bed frame to begin with, and Samuel was making fun of it, but now we're the boss. <laughs> <laughs>
best practice with Ernie on that. What? I don't know. He's dead, John. Black paint has been applied. The bed is looking spectacular. But would you just look at this? Look at the design on the paint can. That looks just like our bed. I see resemblance. Why is that so suspicious? But walk around. Looks you... like nothing happened, right guys? Looks like nothing happened. This looks like how it's been designed from the beginning of time. We're gonna get our full monies back, guaranteed. This is gonna be one excellent gaming room. <laughs> 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 The hidden bed gaming room is complete, so it's time we go inside and show you guys around and see if Andrew and I will both fit inside. It has so much more room than the couch video did. This is three times better. Three times? Oh, all right, let me come inside. Whoa, here I come. All right, I'm going feet first. All right, shut the hatch. Hey! hey. No way. It's definitely a tight fit in here, but it works. You know, plenty of room for us to just chill, except I'm not facing the TV at all. So only I can play video games. We'll give you guys a full tour in a minute. This is probably the first real hidden gaming room inside an object where we both fit inside, which is pretty nuts. Snack drop. Snack drop. Got it. Whoa. Yes. It already smells like BO in there. What? does not. I'm not saying anything. The springs, the end of the springs oh. that kind of stick down a little bit, they can kind of get your back. That's why yeah, I, yeah, I think we should nice. return it. Yeah, yeah definitely. 100%. You can't build That's a port in it. We're missing a bolt right here. Definitely so they should. didn't give us that extra bolt. There we should, should definitely two. return it. Gotta there's, get our money back. There's errors, missing bolts. No charger for the PS5 controllers. What? Load it up. We're putting shrink wrap on it. That way, when we're driving down the highway, the bed sheets and mattress don't fly away. And it kind of almost gives that vibe like, we just got it, don't like it. They did this for us. Very professional. Come on, Blake. It <laughs> <laughs> was terrible. If you do this to somebody at night when they're sleeping in their bed, it's funny. <laughs> This is gonna be nuts. One thing we haven't tested is Andrew inside and just me and Isaac to try and carry it. returning it. It was just, it's just gonna be me and you. I think we got it. Oh, oh my gosh! Andrew, right. heavy. We might need to bring some more friends to help. Friends? Huh? Jackson's a friend. Oh, friend. Freeze is a friend. You try three, two, one. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, Andrew. Time out. Stop, stop. Oh my god. Oh no. <laughs> Oh, the wheel broke. Oh, no. Oh, snap. Oh. Hey, that's, that's why, why we're returning it. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. Everything is fine. Are you ready for the 100 hour yeah, challenge, Andrew? No. Where's the other With the couch, the base was yeah. so wide that the guy even made a comment how weird it looked. Oh, this yeah. is almost that's seamless. Cool. It looks like the most normal bed in the world. <laughs> Whoa. Don't forget, Doe Bear shirts are out now. JSUShop.com. Now let's go return this bed. Our first activity with the hidden bed is to go through a drive through and get some food. I've got the full lights going now, boys. We got donut pillows in here, a comfy blanket, games. Yes. Dude, this whole setup in here is just insane. Yeah. Holy cow. Mania mode. Howdy. Can I get a Chick fil A sandwich for my buddy in the trunk? Gotcha. Okay, can I have a name for the order? Uh, Marv. Yeah, would you mind delivering it to the bed? And my friend's in it. He ordered it. Just knock on the door. Knock on the bed. I feel like I can hear somebody outside. Hello? Oh, yes. Thank you. <laughs> he seemed pretty confused. We just pulled up to the furniture store. We're gonna go inside and see if they accept returns. Let the adventure begin. Mm. Ow. I'm pretty nervous about this bed return situation because with me in the bed, this thing is pretty heavy and I'm hoping they don't drop me. I don't know if we can just just carry this in or what. We can try. Yeah, it's kind of heavy. It's just a, I could get up there and help push it out. Just, yeah, Brad just sold it to us off the clearance and we brought it home. It just wasn't really the working out to be what we expected it to be. So just thought, just bring it back and. Uh, yeah, fair enough. Okay. Yeah, I don't know why it's so Whoa. heavy. <laughs> what is this? This is in our bed. With the mattress and everything too? Yeah. Do you not want the sheets or anything? We could take those off. I just, I don't think we get mattresses at all. You want us to keep the mattress? I'm so confused right now. Yeah, we can take the mattress off. Do you want us to bring it in first? Okay. I we gotta make sure, cause this doesn't look like it's ours. Sorry, what? <laughs> That's what I'm saying, this thing, I know it was on clearance, but when I brought it home, it's just kind of janky, so. You ever seen a bed with Philip on the top? 
Oh, oh my! my God. <laughs> what are you doing, dude? Yeah, I just went to bed. And where am I? <laughs> this is the most excitement we've had all day. So. <laughs> yeah, Heck yeah! And everything in there, dude. Yeah, I got some PS5 and gaming setups. No, you don't. Yeah. Does everything come inside? Because I'll buy it. I mean, <laughs> how long have you been back there? Oh. A while. <laughs> I'm kind of scared and I was like, should we just drop it? <laughs> Even though the employees caught on pretty quick to our hidden bed, I think what we built is still really cool. If you want to watch the hidden bed in a couch, click right here. And if you want to watch this video over here, watch that one next. We'll see you in the next video.